You guys wanted me to play some actual songs on this spinning guitar last video, but I haven't played guitar for three years, so I really made you disappointed. Wow, it's moving too much. But believe me, it's not any easier when the neck is shaped like this. I literally can't see my fingers. The neck is so round. But new year, new me. This entire video is an ad for Rocksmith Plus. Let's try it out. Okay, let's pick instrument. I'm not sure what this is considered. Is there no rather not specify option? Let's start with guitar. So this music library is actually huge. They told me it's over 7,500 songs. We got Green Day, Paramore, Metallica, Coldplay. It's a ton of stuff. Let's take some American Idiot by Green Day. Let's crank up the difficulty to 100. I'm just going to feel this guitar a bit. Yeah, we never get used to this neck moving. Almost nervous. I want to spin. And then come to the next section. Bar chord, no! Wow, how do I do how do I do a bar chord on the round neck? Actually, it might be easier on a round neck for some reason. At least that type. Let's try the riff repeater. Just lower the speed and we will repeat the same section over and over again and it can gradually increase the speed as it notices it that we play it well. Bar chord. Let's do it. Okay, I practiced it a few times now. Bar chord. Yeah. Nice! I see, we got some skills that we could learn. I actually don't know how to do a tremolo on this guitar. Can we get the tutorial? Ooh. Tremolo what is picking tremolo? is very fast alternate picking. Yeah, okay. Most of the motion will come from rotating your wrist. I have an idea. We could actually do the tremolo by not moving the right hand. Instead, we just move the neck. It's kind of genius, actually. I mean, there's no reason to do it, but it looks cool. Was there anything else to learn here? To add vibrato to a note, bend and release the string slightly over and over for the duration of the note length. They wiggle their hand. I think we could do it in a more interesting way. What if we do it like this? <laughs> that actually works. What do you prefer, this? Or... What do you hear that sound? <laughs> I realize this guitar is a bit of a one-trick pony. Like everything it does is just related to some way spinning. But it's it's weirdly addicting to, to do like a, a flip. Whoa, that's cool. But you know what? I feel like we're not really pushing this guitar to its limits because we haven't even used the bass section of it yet. But I have an idea. I just signed up to a second seven day free trial and I'm going to dual wheel two sessions of Rocksmith. One that plays the bass section and one that plays the guitar part. And if you haven't signed up to the seven day free trial yet, what are you waiting for? You only have until the end of January to get this epic offer. We're going to take this on a little world tour, but flying and traveling is expensive but the more of you who sign up to this seven day free trial the more of your favorite guitarist and bassist we're going to have try this out this will be very interesting because i've actually never practiced bass so i actually need to learn bass more than guitar for sure but i've heard that bass is very easy maybe not max difficulty the bass we can probably put max on the bass oh no what have i done bass yeah, nice. Let's stay on the bass. The guitar looks kind of scary right now. Ah. I honestly didn't expect this to work. Like I can genuinely practice this 360 guitar using two accounts like this. Okay, let's go. Jump made famous by Van Halen. That's good when they have such a big library. You actually have some songs that you like. Let's start on the highest difficulty because we're delusional. Let's try the inbuilt tuner. I think we lost some tuning. Okay, I started all at the same time. Oh, it's the guitar part. 
Oh, it's the vibrato. Damn it, I miss, messed up the good part. Let's practice it note by note. So it's going to stop at every note that we need to practice. Here. I'm going to practice this a few times. The guitar is so unbalanced. That's why I don't spin with the right hand because it just falls down. Now let's do it this time. Hello. 94% difficulty. I started on 100. Ah, I see. It has a continuous, like it continuously monitor how bad I play or how good, and it adjusts the difficulty as we play the song. That's pretty. That's pretty good. But it's not good for my ego since I start on 100. It's going to end at zero. Let's start on 100 on each. We can do 100 on bass too. Probably like two notes. This is fun. It's like guitar, but more fun. Let's see if we can get one moment. Oh no, that is like cool. So I can cut that out and make it seem like I actually play this well. Being bass string so thick, I hit my hand on it. Did we get 100% on both sections? Mastery New longest on streak. the bass is zero. <laughs> Wait, no, I didn't hit a single note. But the question is, will I actually remember any of this when I play guitar for my imaginary girlfriend? Let's see. Yeah, not bad, and the bass, right? No one hears the bass anyway, but it's something like... No, that's actually not correct, it's... Some metal. This will not be easy, not even on bass, I think. <laughs> My recommended difficulty is 7 now, I started on 80. Cowboys from Hell, made famous by Pantera, let's... I think this will be good to spot my weaknesses in the bass. Holy! What do we start even? You know what? Let's do something really crazy. <laughs> I can't believe we're doing this. Okay, this is going to be insane. A regular guitar. This actually feels weird. Wow, I could feel this all day. I'm so used to playing something that cuts my hand, but this is like made to actually be played. Maybe I'm not that bad at guitar. Maybe I just played an unplayable guitar. That's what I will tell myself at least. Bending stands for boomer. It's the most boomer sound you can get on guitar is this. Let's try Misery Business by Paramore. Oh, I was going to retune it here, but it's up here now. This song is good, I like this song. I'm happy the library is so big. It has over 7,500 real songs and cover songs. So you can actually find songs that you like. I'm going to practice this section 50 times, and in the end of it, we're going to see if I can actually play it quite well. Let's click. 71 missed notes. What? I didn't practice 50 times, I practiced like 200. But I accidentally, I think I accidentally became a guitar prodigy. So check this, like I'm surprised this comes out of my hands. Oh no, wrong string, <laughs> no. I don't know this part. I've reached level 11 in one day. I practice 150 songs already, which is, I, I'm kind of obsessive. Sign up to the seven day free trial using my link in the description. After the seven day free trial, it's only $14.99 per month. And considering what you get, this is such a good deal. I'm not saying you should use this instead of a private teacher, but it's a great compliment to it. And it's just a fraction of the cost. So join me on my 60 day challenge, where you're going to practice guitar for one hour every day for 60 days and after 60 days you will be surprised just how much better you're going to be at guitar bass or piano 